What's up guys, Titus here with a quick video on how to view or record your League of Legends replays with LOL Summon Information or for short LSI. I've been having some comments lately from people who said they don't really know what to do or if they really have to import their games and the answer is yes. Because as you can see here, you know, I only have one game played apparently on the 11th of December. But if I look up my profile on op.gg, you can see that I have um, more. <laughs> than just that. For example, after the Shen game, which you can, which you can see here, the Shen game, I also have a Garen game, a Nasus game, and a Thrash game. So there is a very easy way to fix this because if you have the program running in the background, it should record any replays. But if they don't show up yet, simply click on uh, replays and then on load missing games. You will have to specify your summoner there. If that's not even there by default, you can simply edit there. But anyway, it's selected already. You can click start and then it will load the matches, so to say, or so to speak. And also, of course, you can view any replays from the time before you have installed the program. So you can't just import all the games because, I mean, you can import an all, all, but you won't see this replay button here for the older games. So if I scroll down here, for example, August seventeenth, uh, there is no replay available because I hadn't, I didn't have the program installed back then. So he is importing the matches now. As you can see, I'm going to scroll back up, and you know it's a pretty slow process, especially for the first time if you're launching the program. But it has to be done, and you can just go AFK for some time, or you know maybe start it in the morning before you go to school or univers university or to work and when you're back it should have loaded almost all the matches there are some issues with some matches i don't know which ones they are but i didn't have it for the uh, for the new patch it's just that when i first loaded the the program and i had over 300 replays or games to import so to say the program told me that it couldn't import like seven or eight matches for some reason and i still don't know which matches they were or if that's a issue or if it's you know a, a different problem or why this even happened in the first place but it's working for for the current games and i didn't have any problems so far you of course have to keep it open in the background because if you close the program it can't record the spectator stream anymore and for example if you load into to the game have this open and you play five minutes and then you close it then you only have the first like two to three minutes of the replay and then it just you know freezes so you need to have it open roughly three to four minutes after a game ends then you have the full replay all right so it has worked now as you can see it's still seven matches seven matches haven't couldn't be imported for some reason, which are the matches from, I don't know when, a long time ago. But as you can see here, like the Shen game is here, the Garen game is here, the Garen game, the Nasus game is here, and the Thresh game is here. So, um, yeah, this is also for patch 4.21, so it does work. The replays from a previous patch do not work, sadly. So from 4.20, which are some older games here, you know, from uh, early December, they shouldn't work anymore, I've heard. But the new ones should work. So let's start the Thresh replay right here. And also, you can't change the camera angle with LSI. I think I've mentioned that in another video, but people always want to use LOL replay, even though it's a shitty... No, it's not a shitty program, but it's just so unreliable and always breaks after new patch. It's really annoying, but everybody loves the LOL replay angles and... LSI doesn't have it, OPGG doesn't have it, Baron Replace doesn't have it, so that's really annoying, but sadly that's the reality and we just, you know, we can wait for an update for LOL Replay. Or maybe if, you, if enough people go to the Facebook page of LSI and say that they would appreciate these uh, camera angles, then maybe they will implement it, I don't know, maybe that's, that's the case, maybe that will, will do something, but for now it's not in this in this version of the software but as you can see it's working fine you know you can jump around it's 4.21 the patch and yeah that's basically it for this time i hope you liked the video and i hope you uh, don't have any problems with lsi anymore thanks for watching and bye bye